Wow. This just in, Jacob Paul defeated Antonio Platinum in a boxing match. <laughs> this is so... C what? What? Jakey Paul just beat Anderson Silva in a boxing match. Anderson Silva, of course, uh, being a former UFC fighter who did a few boxing matches after he retired. He's about 50 years old, 47 to be exact. Uh, good to see Jacob uh, given some more given some more opportunities to the senior citizens of the world, you know, uh, seeing him really give equal opportunities for all, especially those above retirement age. Before anyone says anything, yes, I know, I'm braided, I'm braided up, I had training not too long ago, so that's why it's all braided, and if you're asking about the pigtails, I don't know, uh, usually my girlfriend does my braids, my mum did them this time because she's not here today, and um, I look like a fucking princess what the fuck got my hairline <sighs> it's gonna be a long life it's gonna be a long life jakey beat silver um i wanted silver to win i really did i really wanted him to win uh but he didn't because jake he just keeps just keeps winning he just keeps winning he just keeps winning uh yeah someone someone will beat jake eventually i'm sure hopefully Please, someone. Honestly, anyone. Honestly, let me bulk up to light heavyweight. I'll go fuck him up. Like, genuinely. Like, it's getting to that stage where I feel like I need to step in because no one else is fucking doing it. Um, yeah. Yeah, so. Yeesh, there's only one man that can beat Jake, and that's KSI. Okay, that's a lie. There's actually a, a lot of people that can beat Jake. For example... Vidal Riley. Jake says he wants to fight Vidal next. Uh, good fucking luck, bro. Vidal would murder Jake, and if you think otherwise, <laughs> you're you're not the fastest uh, runner, are you, kid? Fastest runner? That doesn't make sense. Sharpest tool in the shed. I could have said that. Fuck me, man. Anyway, um, yeah. So I think what we really have to ask ourselves is, what was more impressive, Jake Paul defeating? One of the greatest strikers of all time in a boxing match, or KSI beating Luis Pineda in a boxing match. See, it's a bit tough because they're both goats of their respected crafts. Okay, but I'd have to lean towards Jake Paul to be honest. Like all joking aside, Jake looked fucking fast in that fight. Did you see Jake in that fight, bro? My man was fast. Like what the fuck? Faster than KSI, that's for sure. KSI's gonna have to do some serious training if he wants to beat Jake Paul. Like, serious training. It's a bit mad. Yeah. Oh, who's next for Jake? He says Nate Diaz. Why? I thought the whole point was to build up to fighting boxers. Like, you've gone a step forward and now you want to go a step back with Nate Diaz? Get the fuck out of here, bro. I think he should fight... Um. And Jake says he wants to fight Canelo. Give him Canelo. Let Canelo just kill him and then... The, the Jake Paul problem's over, really, isn't it? So who do I think wins in 2023 KSI versus Jake Paul? It's a sticky one. I think KSI is going to win. And I'm saying that, and I'm 100% biased. Going to be real. Very biased in that. But I'll never say KSI loses. Who's better at boxing right now? Jake, without a doubt. In it's showing in performances. We don't know what KSI is like in sparring or against good people. But Jake, bro, that silver fight. Yeah, it was a bit mad. It was a, it was a bit mad. Anyway, uh, that was a quick little video of, you know, what's his name? Logan Paul. Jake. Jacob Paul. Jakey Paul. Jake Paul. Uh, he beat the guy. Uh, Bye. <laughs>